What's it feel like going up against all these established pros? Uh, well, I played against several pros that, from my hometown, and they've always wanted to make TV, and so I'm not only playing for myself, but I feel like I'm playing for some of them, too. It's going to be a lot of match right there. And uh, we've had two questions about your putt-putt. Is your putt-putt <laughs> kung fu still strong? <laughs> it, is, it, it is lacking, <laughs> seriously lacking. It's more like Kung Fu Panda. You know, people have been talking about putt-putt. You know, Riggles even had a blog about Nick Heilman and Andy Mills and Matt McNeil going and playing this high-stakes putt-putt stuff. I think you should. I think you should play those guys in, a, in like a like a uh, legends legends match or something like Once that. Once upon a time, I was okay at it, but it takes some time. You have to. Uh, it really doesn't take any less time to do like anything else to be at the towards the top of anything you do. It, you know, it's just you do it's it a hours lot. and hours and hours and hours. And and putt putt was way. I mean, a lot of it was the prep work. You know, so instead of practicing on one lane to figure out a matchup, you had to do an 18 of them. Yeah. And so I have these old shot cards in a bank bag. So we had our official, official PPA golf balls, and I had my favorite one. That was, of course, the number one. Right. Because that was the goal. Right. And uh, and I had these shot cards, and it, you know, seven tees across the front. So it might say two, left rail, back door, or five, uh, right lip, mm. or I mean, there's just you go through and you drop three balls and you hit them. You hit them straight for a while, and then you hit the left rail and the right rail. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, 15, 20 minutes a hole, and you figure out what shot you like best, and then you go do the whole course, so it takes you, you know, oh my God. six hours to figure out a course, and then you go back and play the shots and start playing rounds and go, all right, I never make I gotta this one. i got to rethink this one. Yeah, yeah. I, gotta, I need a secondary, and then you go back and figure out. That's unbelievable to really so think about that. It's, it's a massive undertaking. You go to national tournaments, and you're, you have to play 54 hole. You know, you play three different courses in the inside of in six rounds. So you, now you, the prep time was massive, and the the return on investment makes makes bowling look like the NFL. So one of the things on my bucket list is I would I would and we've talked about this. I was giving you trouble one night with Callahan and some of the other guys. Mika was there. I do want to play you in a round of miniature golf. <laughs> All right, and it can be it could be like. Uh, the Rocky Apollo fight that never happened and they never discussed the details unless you want to discuss the details. Um, but I would just, I would love to play you in a round of mini golf sometime. It's on my bucket list. It's a good spot. It's not really a putt putt course per se, but it actually is a relatively, most of the holes are relatively skillful. We've done some stuff when we used to have the dream camp there. We, that was part of the deal is, uh, is all the campers and you know we ate together but we played you know in the off hours actually after the campers where we go out and play rounds and and of course there may have may not have been a, a wager sure but that that is one of the things on the bucket that's list. that's a good so spot they have one of the places we actually bowl otherwise you have to go really southeast I mean, north carolina is kind of like the home of it texas is pretty good there's a few places where you can find courses yeah. They're kind of going away. Like There's the, a lot of goofy golf, I, I, but I'd not as much. I'd like to play like 72, though. Yeah. You know? You should live stream in, I think Colleen still has like 54 holes there. I don't have the shots there, though. I, it would be a blind. Blind versus the blind, which I'm not a fan of. I like having the advantage. The, tra <laughs> <laughs> the Travel Channel uh, had a uh, top ten miniature golf courses, places, and stuff like that. We could Did maybe they? revisit that channel Did and they? do that. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, that's all goofy golf, though. That's going to be like volcanoes uh, and dinosaurs. No, yeah. no, no, not necessarily. That's <laughs> not competitive. Yeah. That's not competitive golf. Uh, competitive putt putt, though. <laughs> no, no. I used to like the brand putt putt. It was actual course names. That's, that's right, putt. Yeah, yeah. I like those too. My dad used to take me. All right, let's see. Um, let's see, another question. <laughs> really gotten off the rails here. 